calorimetry. A bomb calorimeter, as shown in the frame, is mainly used for determining the heat of combustion of fuels such as coal, kerosene, oil, petrol, etc. This gives the heat absorbed at constant volume. It consists of a strong metallic chamber, which is commonly known as a bomb. The bomb is made of heavy steel and is capable of withstanding a high pressure which develops inside as a result of combustion. The steel vessel is also lined inside with gold or platinum alloy or some other non-oxidizable substance to check the oxidation of steel during the chemical reactions. It is fitted with a pressure tight screw cap cover and is also provided with platinum cup where the combustion is carried out. The two firing leads are connected to each other through a platinum wire dipping in the platinum cup C. A small known amount of the substance under investigation is taken in the platinum cup. The bomb is filled with excess of oxygen under pressure of 20 to 25 atmospheres and is sealed. It is then lowered in an insulated water bath, which contains a known quantity of water. The water bath is also provided with a mechanical stirrer and a Beckman thermometer, which can read correctly up to 0 0.01 degree. The initial temperature of water is noted and reaction and combustion is started by passing an electric current through the platinum wire. The heat energy evolved during the chemical reaction raises the temperature of water, which is carefully recorded from the thermometer. By knowing the rise in temperature and the heat capacity of the calorimeter, the amount of heat evolved in the reaction can be calculated.